Hey everybody, my name is Daryl O'Bara. Welcome back to my Mondays. So today I'm going to be talking to you about parallel rig evaluation. This was added in Maya 2016 and it obviously gave us the ability to drastically improve the performance of our files. So this is an example of a character and even with the Camtasia software playing um, and recording, it actually plays back very fast. Without Camtasia on this guy, he's actually playing back around 65, 70 frames per second. With the recording software going, he's still playing back, you know, really, really quickly here. And what I want to do is I actually want to start to add a little more life to this character doing some secondary animation that are based on dynamics. So when we first released Maya 2016, if you had dynamics in your scene, um, the parallel rig evaluation would basically get turned off. So I'll show you an example of that now. So I've got a character in here. Let's go ahead and just display some joints on this guy. We'll go back to our, to our first frame on this. And what I want to do is I want to just have a simple spline IK system going down the length of those joints and have that spline IK turned into an in hair. And you can do this very quickly using a bonus tool inside of Maya. So if you grab the end joint and or the first joint in your chain and then your last joint, the little end joint there, and just jump up to bonus tools, go into rigging and say make selected joints dynamic, you have a few choices here on how you're going to go ahead and make this dynamic. So we're just going to use a hair system. In this example, it actually is an in-hair system. So we'll go ahead and we'll hit apply on that guy. And as soon as we do that, if we look in our outliner here, you'll see that we now have the nucleus node and stuff like that. If we play this guy back, notice before parallel rig evaluation was working, everything was getting kicked onto the GPU. But now as soon as I hit rewind and start to play this back, you can see that parallel has been disabled. So this is the way Maya 2016 shipped out of the door. And you can see obviously without the parallel rig evaluation rate, you know, my frame rate's really slow. We have that, you know, nice little secondary animation happening on that tail now. You can see that kind of tail sort of bouncing around a little bit as that guy walks but it's not playing back fast anymore. So in the extension release, we actually have it set up now that you can get the parallel rig evaluation mode not to be disabled if you're using any nucleus-based dynamic system. So the legacy dynamics, things like rigid bodies or um, the classic particles or the classic cloth won't work, but anything that's new or current based on the end dynamic system, it will have the ability to work the parallel rig evaluation if you turn it on. And it's actually in the docs. So if you just hit F1, and inside of Maya and bring up the docs real quick and then just do a sim simple search for this guy. And I think if we just do this parallel rig search here, you can see um, here's the old videos I did uh, for 2016. But if you go down here to what's new in the extension, you can see that we now have the ability to enable dynamics in the evaluation. So there's a simple mail command to enable it and a simple mail command to turn it back off if you want to. So we can go ahead and just highlight that text, copy it and jump over to our script window. And inside of here, if I just paste this guy in and then hit the enter key to, to run that, we've now got it set up so that if we rewind this and play it back, you can see parallel says ready. It's no longer getting turned off. So we're back to that fast frame rate. And you can see that I have that cool little secondary animation just sort of happening on the tail of that character. So it's just a simple um, example of how we can use a bonus tool to add some secondary dynamics onto our character and how we can use that newly added functionality in the extension release of Maya 2016 to make sure that that parallel rig evaluation is still happening so that we get that nice little movement there on that, on that tail. So thanks again for taking the time to check out Maya Mondays. Cheers, everybody.